Hey everybody, this is just a quick demonstration of the Former 2 website and how you can use this tool to accelerate AWS infrastructure development. So uh, the way this works is this is a website um, where I'm not going to go into the credentials section for my own security, um, but I'm going to walk through the setup so where you get an extension for Chrome or whatever browser you're working in. And then you input your credentials, uh, creating a read-only role is preferential here. And I make it with MFA so that it's time limited. And then you can have parameters here where you can add parameters to input to your CloudFormation stacks, for example, and you have settings. So uh, once you're finally at this point in the system, uh, you can configure what you want. And what's going to happen out of this is I click scan account and it's going through and doing a bunch of the API calls to uh, look at my services that I currently have. From there, now that it's scanned all of that, I can go ahead and go to the dashboard. And for example, uh, I happen to have a Lambda in my account. I can just add that, go back um, to the dashboard, and I'm going to look at, say, S3 for this. And when I go to the S3 storage, I can look at this and add that to my selection. And then when I click Generate, this is where the real strength occurs. Uh, I can go ahead and have, for free, out of the box, um, the starting point for configuring that specific resource. So for example, um, this is that Lambda function that I put into this mix. Here's the S3 bucket that I added into here. And this is the cloud configuration code for doing that. Now, if you're not using cloud formation, you can do this in Terraform, uh, for example, or you can do this in the CDK. I happen to set CDK to be in Python, uh, but you can configure this to TypeScript, really any of the languages. And, um, you know, I mean, even if you're so interested, Pulumi, uh, I haven't used this very much, but there's this diagramming tool. So I find this to be a great service uh, for getting started, and I just wanted to highlight those. Now, uh, the obvious thing is, okay, it's scanning my accounts. What about security? So when I'm looking at that, um, right here on the GitHub page for this service, Former 2, um, it does not create any resources. Um, it can only do calls through the JavaScript SDK. And um, when we're looking at this, it, it never sends any information over the internet. It's all kept in memory or on disk uh, while it's doing this. So um, that is how this account works. And I hope this is a helpful illustration of how Former 2 can be utilized.